What is going on Pokemon trainers and welcome to another Pokemon trading card unboxing video. Today we have Elite Trainer Box Sword and Shield Battle Styles. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see this ferocious redness. All right, so we have obviously the artwork from the uh, from the cards itself. We got the different strikes of Urshifu. We love to see them. Then we got this very, very, very aggressive, bad, bad mf -er over here as Tyranitar. And then we obviously have Ampoleon. Shout out to Diamond and Pearl, or Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, however you want to see it. This is what we love to see. So let's put this to the side. An Elite Trainer Box always comes with the Player's Guide. Uh, and I think the Player's Guide usually tells us the cards that are in the set, but we're not going to spoil that. Who cares about that? We'll get to that when we get to it. Pop this sucker off. Boom! You'll love to see it. And we have the, the trading card game rules. I have a pretty good understanding of how they do it. I play it casually on the PC and on the phone. But we got to unbox this sucker. Got some dice. Got the... Got the uh, Status markers, dividers with Urshifu. I, oh, even more close up. This is a pretty nice one. I like this. That's the close up. That's the full body shot. Good to go. Here is our energy sets. God help us. Even I remember seeing those when I was a kid. It was a nightmare. And then we have our sleeves for our holographics. Let's just crack this open. I'm so excited to see what's in the, in the set. So we obviously know that Empoleon's there. We know that uh, Tyranitar and the Urshifus are there as well. But here's our here's our uh, packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight packs, Battle Styles, Sword and Shield, Single, Rapid Strike. We got Sizzlepeed. Wait a minute, this is kind of like a uh, Gumby art style, you know what I'm saying? Mankey, single strike. Shout out to Gen 1. Mankey, so angry. Then we have this looking thing, uh, the the little pawn. I like to call him the pawn. If you've ever played chess, you know you know what that piece is. We got the blip bug with his nice little tie. God bless. Papa bless, excuse me. Uh, Shinx, yet again, shout out to Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. Chimeco is the reverse hollow. You love to see it. Some po people don't like this Pokemon. I kind of like him. He's okay by me. And then we got the Victini. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Oh, my God. Look at him, look at him, look at him. He's putting up the victory sign. Fun fact about this, actually. Uh, everyone knows that the, the V sign is supposed to stand for peace, and it's true. Uh, but there's something about it where, like, depending on how you have your hand. So he has it with the palm out. But if you have it with the palm in, it stands for victory. It was something related to World War II. Very interesting story about that. Not too, too much information I know about that. I just thought it was pretty interesting. So he's got the victory sign, which is why he's called Victini. Uh, I know it's the peace sign, but the V, the V also stands for victory. World War II, shout out back then. Then we have the darkness energy. You love to see it. And then we have Corinna's focus. She's uh, what are those people? What are those people that play that very, very aggressive sport on the roller skates? Shout out to them. Great job for you. Uh, Towers of Waters. And then, oh, Crodont. Look at this guy. I always liked him. Generation 3, I always did like him. And then we have the uh, the thingy. So, there you go. Uh, we got to sleeve up our Victini. First pack, right out the gate. Already with a victory card. Love to see it. I guess the fact that it was open or unsealed didn't really matter because I got a Victini. And that's pretty good. Okay, Victini is in the thing. So, next pack. Crack this sucker open. Not a clean cut either. Forget about it. Ooh, we love to see this guy. I try my best not to bend the cards. We got Esper. Shout out to these eyes. You love to see it. Uh, let's see. Electabuzz, buzz, buzz. Pokemon Snap. Shout out to him. Lickitung. Lots of Generation 1 Pokemon in this. Gen 1ers out there. Uh, in comments below, let us know. Cherubi. Very odd, but interesting Pokedex. Apparently, Pokemon like to eat that thing. Very weird. Horsey! Um, that was a terrible. Horsey, you'll love to see him. Reverse Hollow of the Fan of Waves. Pretty good. Oh my god, Topi uh, 
Tapu Koko V. Oh my goodness, two packs. Did we just like get all the good ones right in the beginning? If that's the case, kind of unfortunate, but another V card, very interesting. Uh, Alola, uh, energy obviously. Urn of Vitality, kind of a weird card, single strike. Then we have this guy. How you doing, Tauros 2.0? And then we have, oh my goodness, Ursula. Uh, and then we have the card, obviously. There you go. Um, hold on a second. Let's, let's put the Mr. Coco V in the sleeve. I really hope we do get some more V cards. Uh, oh my god, that didn't sound right. <laughs> I hope we get some more V cards. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry. This is a Christian Minecraft channel, people. Alright, Lick a Tongue right off the bat. God, these packs are very weird. The glue on this one isn't that good. Okay. Lick a Tongue, Tongue, Tongue. H Houndor. I really like this guy. Generation 2, single strike. One move, bite. He's kind of training, though, so he should be evolving pretty soon. Then we have the Cobra, Cobra Kai. Another Blip Bug, another Esper. Reverse Hollow of a Victor Bell. I like Victor Bell, especially when he har harasses James. Is this a star card? It is a star card. So I don't know if he's generally hollow, but it's a star card Reverse Hollow. Interesting to see. And then we have a Cheerum, Evolution of the Cherubi. Good to see. Nice, nice to, we got three packs, all with hollows. This is our first regular hollow. So we're gonna put him to the side. Shout out to the steel, nerves of steel. Then we have the double blades. And then we have a very agitated and very aggressive Morpeko. Very angry, He's, he might be, uh, he might be upset that he's eaten all of his apples. So that's okay. Then we have rapid strike style mustard. I remember him in the game, very interesting fellow. Kind of reminds me of Master Roshi in uh, Dragon Ball Z. Shout out to all my Dragon Ball Z fans out there. Although I really don't know that many people that don't like Dragon Ball Z. At least that are, um, you know, normal people, I guess. <laughs> when I mean normal people, I mean I know I know there's quite a bit of a population that doesn't really care about anime. But most anime people I know at some point probably got into anime thanks to Dragon Ball Z. So shout out to Master Roshi. Oh, he's kind of a weird guy with his own vices. Um, but, you know, it's a cartoon. Um, okay. Then we got the Hone Edge. Love to see it. Evol a pre-evolution of a card that we got previously. Double Blade. Chimeco, not Reverse Hollow this time around. Uh, Pachirisu in attack position. So I summon you into attack position. Pachirisu, Cherubi again. We have a single strike Mawile. Interesting. Reverse Hollow Cherubi. This guy's gonna haunt me now because I, I made fun of the fact that people eat the little thing on his back. Uh, then we have, ooh, this Pokemon. Very interesting in the game. It's kind of a nightmare to collect them all. Vavilion. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. And then we have, obviously, our um, Electric Golbat. Dark type. Not your typical, um, well, I, what, what, what does he usually come in? I don't know. Dark type gold bat. Tool jammer. Per ugly. Always feel bad for that Pokemon. I don't know why they always call him ugly. You know, he is kind of ugly. Um, we do not shame people for their physical appearances on this channel. I keep breaking them in a specific way, too. I don't know. I don't know. Uh-oh. Spoilers. Something big's coming. Wonder what it could be. We got the Cobra. Cobra Kai. Glam Meow. Pre-evolution of Perugly. Finally, Tep Pig. Shout out to his evolution right there in the back with the training montage. I really like this training situation. Again, Cobra Kai. Um, Timber. I'm talking about Cobra Kai the show. I think this has a lot to do with Cobra Kai the show, to be honest with you. We got the pawn over here, Mr. Chess. Prime Ape. Ash's Prime Ape. Where's his hat? He's training hard. We love a good monkey. Oh my god, I love this Pokemon so much. We got the Stout Land. I have a Yorkie. I love her so much. I, every time I can get the opportunity to catch this Pokemon, I get the female version. I name him my dog, Mila. Shout out, I love you. Uh, and then we got the evolution of him, the V version. Let's go. Uh, put him to the side. And then we have the Grass, Crawdon again. 
Victoros 2.0, Scroll of Swirls, Rapid Strike, and then obviously this thingy. So not bad, not bad. Eight packs, four hollows, three of them are V cards. Uh, I didn't really look too much into the set. I like to be surprised, and then when I'm done collecting uh, stuff for the set, I just sort of grab whatever I need afterwards. So that's pretty fun. I'm still in the journey of collecting them all when it comes to the cards. Cobra Kai, yet again. Glam Meow, yet again. Tepig, yet again. Tim, here we come with the du Every pack in... Okay, every card we had gotten so far was a duplicate, but we got Bruno of the Elite Four of the Kanto region. Gets a lot of hate. We love him. We love to see him. So, my guy Bruno over here. And then we have Electra Vive. Yo, look at him. Very aggressive. He's, he, he's, he's doing that thing that, like, you see in animes often with the hands and stuff. Yo, I love it. We love to see it. Not holographic, though, so that's unfortunate. Darkness and Energy, a very interesting art style for Grumpig. That's okay. And Gr this guy's everywhere. And so is this guy. This guy's everywhere too. And then boom. Okay. Mankey, Horsey, Lickitung, Houndor. Come on. Cobra Kai, Yamper. One of the greatest Pokemon to come out of the latest generation. We love to see him. Very cute, very cuddly. Got a heart on his hiney. Love to see it. And then we have, what is this? Lorantis. Whoa. Not too often that I see him in the game. Kind of fire, honestly. Look at that. Uh, uh, Grass Energy. Girder. Kind of never, never was a fan of this guy's name. Nothing against him, but the name, not a fan of. And then we got the Urn of Vitality, Energy Recycler. Kind of remember this as being an old school Pokemon card. And then we have the card code. And this is it, folks. It comes down to this. This is the last pack. Oh my goodness. All the money. All the money is on this. Let's go. Let's. I, I know that they have full art cards. Let's go. Let's hope we can get one of the guys on the front of the pack. Tyranitar, Empoleon, Urshifu, Single, or, or Rapid. Glam meow right off the bat. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. We got the cat. We got the dog. We got Mr. Fu right here doing his splits. Can't do that. Maybe one day I will be. I do kind of like that connection over there with the feet. Kind of weird. Bell Sprout looking like he's getting some drizzle on him. Okay, that's okay. Uh, one, one wrong move and it'll kick your grass. Shout out to the song. We got we got Mrs. Bandit. Goodness gracious. Very interesting kind of look at me. Look at me. Hold on. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. This is the face of a menace. Focus. Please focus. This is a face of a menace. Galarian Slowpoke. Kind of really like that. Actually, kind of really like that. Shout out. Clay Doll. Always remind me of that Yu-Gi-Oh card. Thousand Eyes Restrict. Kind of thought of them. Then we have whatever the heck this thing is. Darkness Energy. We got the Focus again. Tower of Darkness. Heat more. And that's that. And there's the code. And that's really it for the Sword and, Se Sword and Shield Battle Styles Tr Elite Trainer Box. No Urshifu, no Tyranitar, no Empoleon, but that's okay. Let's do a recap of what we were able to acquire. We got my Yorkie. Love you. Shout out to my Yorkie, Mila. We love to see you. Here we go. Then we got Chiram. Then we got Tapu Koko V. Kind of, I think he's the most iconic of the uh, Tapus uh, that there are. And then we have probably the best pull being our Victini V. You'll love to see it. I love it. I don't know how many cards I have in this set. Apparently, the set contains... Oh, can't focus. A minimum of 163. So, we have a lot to get. But, thank you for being a part of this unboxing. Be sure to subscribe. We're doing Let's Plays. We're doing video or movie commentary. We might do some meme reviews. But, we're obviously going to do some more Pokemon card unboxings. So, be sure to subscribe. Be sure to stay tuned to the channel. Thank you so much. Uh, uh, clickety-clack that like button for some victory, and I'll see you guys in the next video.
Uh, remember, trainers, gotta catch them all.